morning, YouTube family. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. If this is your first time at Ryefields Refuge, my name is Mindy. My husband's name is Leon. We have a small farm in Philadelphia, Mississippi on the outskirts of the city. And so um, we have only been living here a little over four years, I believe, and we are thoroughly enjoying it. This is great hunting areas out here. We own 18 acres and little by little, when we moved here, it was just nothing but land and trees and weeds and everything was grown up. So everything that you see in my videos, we have done. Put our house here and all of that. And so little by little, we are building up our property and um, adding things and moving things. We plan on building a pond on the back 10. So Leon has been working very hard out there. We have a variety of the videos and um, it's not all about one subject it's not all about prepping it's um, a little bit of everything we like to show our life in uh, real time and things that we do in our home our animals our family uh, we have family that live in louisiana is where i'm from and we have family that live in florida is where leon's from we are real people and we all go through a lot of the same things you guys go through and so We've built a community where we can share and communicate and talk. We email each other and we just have a wonderful time and we encourage one another, lift one another up, and we also pray for one another. So we serve our Lord and we are thankful and give him all of the praise and the glory for anything and everything in our life. So Leon and I welcome you to our home and welcome to Raffield's Refuge. Just come on in because we've got a lot going on today. We thank you for giving us your time and we hope you enjoy this video. So today is the day that Leon hooks up the mini split air conditioner in the sunroom. And so he is just getting the parts and everything ready. This is the window unit that we have in there now. This Comfort um, Star is a heat and a cool system and it's high efficiency. This is the outside unit. And so he is getting everything prepared to install it. So what it does is uh, you take this metal plate, Leon's trying to get all his measurements right, and he's gonna mount it. We're gonna take the air conditioner out, of course. So he's gonna mount it onto the wall. This inside unit, he has it taken apart. This is what it looks like. And this goes on the wall. So as you can tell, he's got a lot of important things going on. It's a 12,000 BTU little mini split, and it covers up to 500 square feet. Our sunroom, Count Myers' room, is 402, so it's pretty efficient enough to do what we need. It's only 5,000 BTUs, so this is what was recommended for us to use. Okay. This should give you a little extra more. This 12,000 BTU is probably more energy efficient than this window unit. Alright, and tell us where you got it from. One of the little guys that works for me at work, uh, he does this on the side, and he got me this little unit at cost. Yeah, he got him the unit at cost, so that was a blessing, huh? Yes, it was. I'm trying to get his all hooked up today and get rid of this thing. <laughs> Amen. Leon continues to work on that project, and I will uh, update you and show you when he moves a little further along. Um, I'm just making tuna fish for us. We're going to have a tuna fish sandwich for uh, lunch, supper. It's already 218, and with some fresh tomatoes out of our garden. But I wanted to stop and show you what I got in the mail yesterday. So it is the Amish Canning Cookbook. It has some wonderful things inside. I just want to tell you whose YouTube channel that I ordered this off of, and it's called Make It Make. And I'll put a picture up here. Um, this lady went through my YouTube feed, and I clicked on it, and she has some wonderful information, and she has an Amish friend. She's got a lot of good tips, so you might want to go check her out because uh, so far I'm enjoy wa enjoying watching her. Then guys, it talks about the altitudes of each thing and the times that you can them. Um, it has meats, jellies, jams, of course, how to make ketchup. And you know that the Amish people know what they are doing. 
So if you want to pause it right there. So I think this book was $13 and something. And it has a spiral thing. And let me tell you how many pages it has. 211 pages. He is not finished by any means because he has to do all the electrical, all the piping. He's got to hook an electrical box uh, to the house and things like that. I will show you those things. But I'm making us our lunch. I take you back outside I just wanted to show you um, some of this is the cookbooks that I have and a lot of them are like this is the good housing and um, cookbooks from people's church that I got from flea markets and stuff and you need to get some cookbooks because like I always tell you that the internet may not always be available to you and then also this is my I have the Back to the Basics books, the Survival um, Medical book, and a bunch of very good information in these books, how-to books. So, it's just always wise to have a good selection of those types of books. And then, of course, I added the Amish Canning Cookbook. Okay, so he already has got the front uh, mounted to the wall, uh, the front unit mounted to the wall. So let's go outside and see what he's doing. Wow. All right, so he's pulling everything through. Leon is still working so I thought I would take the time and I had to go feed the animals and everything because Leon is very busy so um, I did all that so it is hot out there I'm sweating but I wanted to um, this is my paints and I just put this picture here that I painted a while back and it's a lady sitting on a beach <laughs> I had it in the closet but um this is what I been using so I wanted to tell you that I ordered me a what I'm going to use as a paint desk with the shelf attached and I'll put a picture up in here and I'll also tell you how I'm going to put it in the sunroom. These are my paints. I do acrylic painting and not oil base 
and um, everything is kind of unorganized right now but let me show you and then I have stuff in that bag okay so all that is my paint stuff I just put it right there for now and the, the, on this side of the sunroom on this side of the sunroom the back door and that's the new air conditioner Leon's putting in is a space right here so this is where my painting station is going to be in between these two windows not to block the windows so the shelf is going to go there and then the desk is going to come out this way we've already measured it and everything and then I'll put a chair I'll be able to sit on that side or this side that way I can put my paints on the shelf and I'll have everything organized and then I'll have a place if I sit on this side I can see Maya and talk to her so Leon is almost finished he said and he's about to turn the air on so let me go check on him sitting by Maya's room and I can feel it way over here let me turn the camera around he still has to take the window out of the window unit out it is so quiet it is so peaceful in here now the little window unit is so loud and this one right here you can barely hear it so it is digital and the air is coming out of there there's a little rotating thing or you can not rotate it but when you turn it on, this little flap falls down on its own. Let me show you the remote. So this is the remote to it, and I don't even know how to work it, but Leon, see, it can swing. There's your fan speed. I don't know what that is right there. And uh, I'll have to read the book. Leon is going to join me in just a minute, but I just wanted to tell you I'm going to close out the video uh, showing a few of my paintings that I painted over the, uh, the last six years I guess and so um, I hope you enjoy those okay YouTube family the air conditioner is working wonders I mean it I'm gonna really be able to tell tomorrow around three o'clock when it usually gets kind of hot in there and so um but so far it is cold in there and you can feel it from afar well Leon is tired he is gonna take the window out unit out tomorrow from the window he still has some other things that he has to do and so we're gonna go ahead and let you go we love you guys. Thank you so much for watching our videos. And until next time, we'll see you on the next video. God bless. Bye, guys. Bye.